Good morning. Glad you're with us this morning for the Union City Presbyterian Church Worship Service. We open our service with music. It's the song, More Love to Thee. Fisherman. 
And Jesus, here in this story, had prepared a breakfast for his disciples after he had risen from the dead of fish. And Jesus is asking Peter, I think, Peter, do you love my way, my cause, my desire for the world, lambs and sheep, more than your satisfaction, more than your sustenance, more than your skills, more than your life goals, fish. And Simon Peter again and again has to say, yes, I love you, yes, I love you. And we try to do that as well. Yes, Lord, I love you. I try to be a good person. I go to church. I don't willingly do awful sins. But that's not what Jesus asked. Jesus asked this, feed my lambs. Feed my sheep. If we love him, we are feeding other people the grace the love, the justice, the mercy, the forgiveness, and the righteousness that Jesus gives and feeds to us. Who are Jesus' lambs? We don't know. Who are Jesus' sheep? His church and people we don't know. And Peter, looking at that because he hears it. He's lived for fish. He's lived for him. He's asked to live for Jesus. And so he tries to duck it. Hey, Jesus, what about this other guy over here? What do you got to say about him? And Jesus says, it doesn't matter what I have to say about him, because I'm not talking to him talking to you. Church, Jesus is talking to us. Do we, do I love him? And if I answer yes, if you answer yes, feed his sheep. That's how he knows we mean. We enter now a time of prayer. We begin musically with the joy that comes from serving Jesus. It's a song called, Oh, How I Love Jesus. Thank you. 
used to call significant to do, you still say, feed my sheep, feed my lambs. When we seek your purpose, we will find ours. And when that freedom, in that love, O oh God, the world will be blessed. And through your grace, touched, and perhaps made better. If not the world, at least us. We ask that this happen to us and through us. To the glory of your name. Amen. Our benediction is this. We are starving for normalcy. Jesus is starving for our life to be changed. We are aching to be free of hesitations and strictures and rules and regulations. Jesus is yearning for us to follow him. Choose well what you really want so that you know that you are really loved in Jesus' name. Our benediction response is a tradition here in the congregation. May the grace of Christ our Savior.